Hello everybody and welcome back to another video with Sons of the Forest and having fun with Manipulate Your Safe Game Files. Well, I don't know if you just looked at my other videos in the past. I just released today an update for my Sons of the Forest toolbox script that will allow you to easily tame Virginia or every Virginia that you spawned in the game by the toolbox. So the toolbox can take over your inventory to another save game file. The toolbox can heal your NPCs, your friendly NPCs if they're down. And of course the toolbox can also spawn NPCs like Calvin and Virginia. Currently there's no implementation for enemies, but maybe there will in the future. And the thing I want to show you today, uh, this video, so to speak, is how to tame Virginia in seconds. Well, obviously I'm just starting a completely new game and I'm here in the forest. I think it's the second start point of the game. The first is, I believe, the strand. The third is in the snow on the mountains. So, and we quickly revive our one and only Calvin we got. So, and right after, I would like to ask Calvin just to build a tent for us or shelter. So, manipulating your safe game only works when you have a safe game and therefore we just have to save once and we must make sure that the safe game you wanted to alter is the most current safe game because my script will look for your most current safe game and alter exactly this one. So there is no need for selecting your safe game basically. Just save your save game or save your game once again so to speak and the script will address that so let's save it once i'll take a new save so then quit exactly then let's head over to my website surbash.com also, you get here the link for my Discord if you would like to provide any feedback or have something to say or want to join the community. Welcome to my Discord server. If you only want to download the script, you can go with GitHub Stuff I Develop. Then go to Repositories, click on Sons of the Forest Toolbox, then on the green button and say Download Zip. Well, he's asking for the download folder. And when you're done, just head to the download folder, then extract the zip file. And here's the content of the zip file. Here's the readme file. This is an inventory I will provide with the zip file if you want to inject your inventory data. Just copy your inventory here in the script folder. Then when you want to execute the script, right click on init.cmd, say properties, and then allow the execution of the file. The init.cmd is like the Kickstarter for the engine.ps1 and every intelligence is here in the engine.ps1. So if you're interested what's inside, it's completely source open to you. There is nothing that will the script hide from you. Just look in and probably, I don't know, extend it, um, do something with the script you just want to do. Probably I give you here idea you, you just need it. And anyway, let's execute the script. And then you get four options. Insert your inventory. Yes, I want to do that. I want to just inject my inventory, then start a script again. Revolve your NPCs, all of them. Well, none of my NPCs are down, so <laughs> there's no need. Insert additional Virginias and Calvins to your game. Yes, I would like to do that because it's probably taking a while when the Virginia that is currently in the game will meet me. So I'm just doing like, say, five Virginias additionally and zero Calvins. 
and I am currently in the forest. All right, it's complete. Every dot here represents an inject of an additional NPC, so we got five dots for Virginia and zero dots for Calvin. So after that, I want to tame them. So you're free to choose if you insert more or only tame the current Virginia you got. So I'm just enter here four for tame and weaponize all Virginias. Exactly, weaponize is a thing you will get with the tame and complete it. So, then let's head over back to our save game. Oh, 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 okay, okay. Here we go with... Okay, I count four. Oh, here, here too. <laughs> These are six legs, I count. And I can... Can I talk with all of them? Let me see that. Yes, I can. Can I talk with you? Yes, I can. Can I talk with you? I can. All right, perfectly. So here we go with our bodyguard crew. Of course, I got my inventory also. And maybe we go today with like this. Yes, I like it. All right, you see, it is pretty easy to handle. You can start over, have a new game. And of course, it's working with single player and multiplayer, at least when you are the host. Goodbye!